It's your boy G1 Basement. Today I'm gonna teach you how to fix your mic. The, the video today is gonna be in Spanish and in English, so just bear with me, please. El día de hoy yo le voy a enseñar a ustedes cómo arreglar su mic, pero lo vi, el video va a ser en inglés y en español. So por favor, eh, eh, llévame suave, por favor. Okay? So let's go. Let's go right to it, and I'm gonna teach you step by step how to do it. Let's go. So. The first step right here. The first step you want to do, you want to go where it says profile. And um, either you you go to profile or, or and then scene, you were seen, and then you just create it. So I'm, I'm just going to delete this that I already had right here. And um, yeah, that's basically, that's the first step right there. La primer, la pri, el primer paso que tienen que hacer mi gente es eh, ir aquí donde dice profile y buscar un, un profile nuevo. Poner un profile nuevo o una escena nueva. Es el primer paso que tienen que hacer. Simplemente eso. Poner una escena nueva o un profile nuevo aquí, como ustedes quieran. O una escena nueva. Una escena nueva para, para ustedes es perfecto. Para que prueben lo que estoy haciendo. Ok. The next step, guys. The next step you wanna go to. You're gonna go to settings. You're gonna go to settings right here. And you're gonna go to audio. You're gonna go to audio. Which says a sample rate we go to sample rate and you're gonna want to put 44.1 why 40.1 because when i was looking up 44.1 was the the best thing that there was for me and um i really i'm not gonna say like i really don't know why like i'm not gonna be like i know why i just know it's 44.1 so just put 44.1 bear with me i'm not an expert but i know how to at least fix your mic a little bit so 44.1 and then channel here put a, a stereo okay so para ustedes mi gente que hablan español van aquí, en allá, van aquí abajo donde dicen settings okay y van aquí donde dice el audio ese es el segundo paso y van aquí donde dice, donde dice um, a sample rate y lo van a poner en 40 en 44.1 y lo van a poner el channel aquí en el stereo okay eh, realmente no lo voy a decir que por no lo voy a decir que yo sé por qué no es 48 o 44 pero así fue que yo aprendí eh, ahora mismo no sé cuál es la diferencia pero creo que es lo mejor que pueden poner um, and the next step is you say you, you guys see what it says um, global audio device you want to put this all disabled you want to disable you want to disable everything here only because you don't want OBS to um do that stuff for you you know because if you put it at this full obs kind of gonna have the control and you really don't you want to have the control of everything and you want to you want to um put everything yourself you know so it, it's better trust me it's gonna be better so el, el paso siguiente mi gente es que van a ir aquí donde dice global audio device y lo van a poner todo aquí disable okay Porque tú no quieres que OBS haga, dejar que OBS haga todo manualmente. Tú quieres tener control de lo que tú estás haciendo. Tú quieres eh, controlar lo que tú estás haciendo. Entonces lo que vamos a hacer es que vamos a poner todo manualmente. Ok. So aquí donde dice Global Device, vamos a poner todo disable aquí. Esto aquí. You're going to put everything here disable. And then you're going to go here. Vamos a bajar aquí. Apply. And then you're going to go OK. That's it. That's, that's. That's the two step that I just showed you right there. Oh, third step. Eso es todo lo que van a hacer ahí en settings, okay? The next step. The next step, you're going to go here where it says plus right here. And you're going to add an audio input, okay? You're going to go to audio input. Um, You're going to go here. I'm not going to um add another one. I'm just going to put a, create a new one. I'm not going to add that the the thing that I already had so I'm just gonna add a new one okay and then you're gonna go here where it says device and you're gonna go and find the your mic so I have the the audience device this is my mic here this is the one I use so I'm just gonna put it and said okay and that's it you see the mic is already there so para la gente que habla en español um van a ir aquí donde donde dice plus ¿Verdad? Um, le van a dar a audio input. Audio input. Le van a, a crear un nuevo aquí. Ok. 
en donde dice device, le van a poner el micrófono que tienen y después le van a dar OK. I'm just gonna remove that because that was just for the, the people who were, um, spoke Spanish. I'm just gonna remove it real quick. Ok. En ya todo tienen que tener esto aquí abajo. Everybody is supposed to have everything right here. So, the next step, guys. This is what you really want to concentrate on. You want this to be in the yellow line and a little over the red line. So, this is when your filter are going to come in heavy, you know. El nuevo, eh, lo que ustedes quieren es, eh, mi gente, es que cuando ustedes hablen, eso esté aquí en, el, eh, en amarilla, en la línea amarilla y en la línea roja, ¿ok? So, aquí cuando lo pongamos los filters, van a ser lo cla la clave para que su micrófono suene mejor, ¿ok? Esto fue lo que yo hice porque mi, micro mi micrófono no sonaba muy alto y la gente no lo podía escuchar cuando yo jugaba en Twitch o, o cuando hacía video en YouTube, ¿ok? This is why I did it. Because when I used to live stream on, on Twitch or YouTube, people um, couldn't hear me. So this is what helped me out. So I'm trying to help you guys out by doing it, okay? So the next step is you're going to go to says filters, okay? El paso que van a hacer, van a ir donde dice filters, okay? Síganme todo aquí. Vamos a ir donde dice filters y vamos a entrar. Okay. So I'm going to go one by one. Voy a ir uno por uno in Spanish. En inglés, lo voy a explicar en, en el español una vez y lo voy a explicar en inglés una vez. I'm going to explain it in Spanish once and in English once. So, just bear with me because I'm trying to help both community out, guys. I know it's, it's hard, but bear with me because I'm trying to help. I'm trying to use my advantages that I speak two languages. Or that, I, you know, I try to speak two languages. <laughs> However you guys want to uh, put it. But, um, okay, so the first step... The first thing you want to do is you can either put noise gate or no noise compression, okay? So, when you go to noise compression, um, I'm not going to put noise gate because noise gate is for when you have a little, when you have a lot of no noise in the back and you want to black that. Like, when you when you have, like, I don't know, maybe three people on the back, uh, like, talking and talking and maybe the TV is on. So, you can put noise gates for that. But I'm not going to use it because, um, and leave it as default. I'm not going to use it because I don't need it. My, there's not that much noise in the back. I only got my wife in the back making noise. So I don't need it. I don't need it as much. Okay, so I'm going to go with noise compression right here. Okay. And I'm going to leave it as default here. You don't want to do, you don't want to do anything with this. I'm not, I'm not going to, you know, do anything. I'm just going to leave it like that. That's it. Noise compression is gonna black the noise in the back that is going on, so my viewers don't have to hear anything that my wife or my wife is screaming at me or anything like that's about it. That's why I'm putting the noise compression. Um, señores, el nuevo, el otro paso que le que le dije es poner aquí van aquí donde dice donde dice plus aquí y aquí dice noise compression, verdad? Tienen dos opciones. Pueden poner donde dice noise gate o noise compression. Yo no voy a poner noise gate. Porque noise gate es para la, cuando hay mucho sonido atrás y tú quieres eh, bloquear todo ese sonido atrás. Pero yo no tengo tanto sonido en mi casa, tú me entiendes. Yo no tengo tanto sonido que yo necesito esa noise gate. Que yo creo que noise gate es más fuerte que noise suppression, ¿ok? So, si, si tú tienes eh, mucho sonido en tu casa, tú vas a usar noise gate. Pero yo, como no tengo tanto, nada más tengo la mujer mía que siempre me está gritando y, y la televisión a... Uh, prendida, so yo puse noise compression, y lo van a dejar, lo van a dejar así como están, normal, no lo van, no van a dejar nada, like, no van a ajustar nada de lo que tienen, lo van a dejar así mismo, como está, ok, the next step, the next step you gotta do, the next step, is you gonna go here, and you gonna go and put a compressor on it, ok, the compressor, you know why you're doing this, you're gonna leave it just how it is, This is just gonna help your voice sound clean and more smooth. And it's gonna level the sound and everything. And you're gonna leave it as default. Van a ir aquí de nuevo y van a poner compressor. Van a quitar plus, van a poner compressor. El compressor es solamente para que su voz suene más limpia, más suave. Y la van a dejar como están, como está así. No lo van a tocar, no lo van a ajustar nada, lo van a dejar así mismo, ¿ok? Simple, simplemente así, señores. Um, the next step, 
you're gonna have this right here gain okay gain why did what's gain for so basically uh let me move this right here you see your boys right here um you want the your boys to sound to be on the yellow line right here and a little on the red line but you don't want to you don't want it to go over the the peak right here so you regain right here you want you want to have this add well it depends actually so you gotta put whatever you need so your boys can go to the yellow right here and a little on the red so i have the mic a little farther so i'm gonna put it at 10 which is what i need honestly because i don't 10 10 70 is fine for me because you guys can see it goes to the yellow and it doesn't in some time it goes if i'm screaming obviously when i'm playing games it goes over here but right now i'm not so i'm just gonna leave it right there so it doesn't go over it when i'm playing games and all that so that's about it but you guys probably gonna need it like a two or three honestly because if you have an arm that is right on your face um you probably just need like three para la gente que habla en español mi gente le vamos a agregar aquí este que se llama game van a ir plus de nuevo y le van a agregar game para que van a poner game game se usa para ayudar que su voz aquí abajo llegue al, a, la ni, a la niña amarilla y roja ok no quieren que se pase mucho tampoco de aquí so ustedes si tienen un brazo que tienen su, su, su micro su micrófono Um, cerca de su boca seguramente solamente van a poner aquí un 3 pero yo como tengo mi, mi mic un poquito retirado lo pongo en 10 para que mi, mi voz llegue aquí ve como sube ahí a, a lo amarillo y, un, y cuando estoy jugando los juegos llega un poquito a los rojos también pero no quiero que se pase ok so, para eso pongo game por eso lo pongo el game y lo último que van a poner the last thing you guys gonna do is put this limited right here what is what's limited for is basically is gonna uh, prevent you from destroying your viewers um preventing you from destroying your, your viewers ears that's basically it that's basically it, what you guys are gonna do so you want this at three uh you want to put this at three right here so you don't destroy your viewers ears basically so you just want this at three hold on three 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 negative three hold on hold on right here three So that's what you want. El nuevo, el último paso realmente es limited. You, tú vas a poner eso ahí donde dice limited. Y lo vas a poner en 3, en menos 3.00 dB. Porque es, es negativo 3, perdón. Y realmente eso solamente va a ser eh, para evitar que tú eh, no suene tan fuerte en la, eh, a esa gente que te están, que están viendo your stream so y que no le duelen los oídos de escucharte a ti si límite también te va te va a prevenir de, de pasarte de la línea roja de ma, o going overboard so that's basically it that's basically it guys that your your mic um should um sound better right now so basically let's go over it let's go over it so noise compression noise compression is um to black the sound on the back on the background you know so it doesn't go through your stream like whatever your people or whatever is arguing well it's gonna try to black that at least that compressor is gonna help you sound more smooth and clean gain is for the volume so you go um so you won't between the yellow and red and limited is just gonna help you not go over the peak so mi gente el overview que, le, que de lo que hicimos es noise compression se usa para los sonidos atrás um a compressor para que tu voz suena suena más limpia y más um, smooth y gain es para que subas el volumen de, de para que tu voz esté aquí de, de en, la, en la línea amarilla y un poquito en la, en la roja y um, limite es para que no te vaya pasado que no te pase de la línea roja y tú sabes eh, suena tan mal entonces para eso se usa en das So that was it guys. If you guys like the video, please thumbs up. Um leave a comment down below. Maybe a question if you guys want me to help you out with something else. Um follow me on Twitch. Remember I live stream every Wednesday night. Link down below. Señor, esto es todo por el día de hoy. Dale un like al video. Deje un comentario en la caja de comentarios. Eh, una pregunta si quiere que te ayude con algo más que tal vez yo pueda ayudarte. Y recuerda que yo hago live stream todos los miércoles en la noche. Links down below. G1, out.